So, back on topic. I wonder what kind of person the culprit is. If you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. Maybe it was her lover's wife. But Miss Suzu Hiraki had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it, it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Uh, so we can kind of rule her out as the suspect then. Really? You know an awful lot about it. It was this. Chie! Okay, what about the second case? Saki Senpai. She found the announcer's body. Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target Senpai? Well, to, <clears throat> to shut her up, probably, since she saw the body and may have found a detail that wouldn't be known otherwise. Yeah, I think so too. Maybe she found a clue or something about the culprit. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? Maybe he had to pull her back out and then hang her up. Who knows? I don't think he would have left evidence the police, much less a high school student, would catch. Yeah, exactly. Man, I thought the countryside would be a snooze. But it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. Oh, they updated the menu. Huh, isn't he that detective? If you want to give him, give him that much credit and defame the word detective that badly, yes, um, he is a detective. Moron. Hey, you were at Dojima-san's. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanako-chan? Sure. She should be happy to hear that. Yo, I'm Adachi, Dojima-san's gopher. Uh, I mean, his partner. <laughs> you mean slave. <laughs> Are you this busy every day? Huh? Oh, well, the public seems to be getting a charge out of these cases, but we can't leave it at that. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki Senpai in order to silence her? Um, you sure get to the heart of the matter. Yikes! <laughs> well, that's Chie, very straightforward with what, with what she wants to know. Of course, we're also thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. If the killer was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she would have understood. Which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. It was Yosuke. I knew it. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. Uh, don't tell anyone I said any of that, or Dojima-san will flay me alive. <clears throat> Relax, kids. The police are on the job. Um, if you're the police, I don't think I can relax. See ya. Oh, you were right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. <laughs> agreed, Chie. Agreed. <gasps> oh, my steak's getting cold. Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? Well, she was shut up for a good couple minutes, Yosuke. I mean, we're talking to... Adachi and everything, right? What a team of misfits that I have. Well, but they're exciting at least. Wow, this really is inside the TV. Teddy, that it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. Oh, I see. Good boy. <laughs> well, this bear's part of the reason we want to find the culprit. He kind of, like, forced us into doing it. I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep, I was thinking the same thing. 
That's why I got these ready for you, Yuki-chan. Oh, so these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. You're right. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. It's pretty cool being able to see in here, isn't it? Oh. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? Excellent question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. Uh, I, th I thought you were just finding them somewhere. And if that was the case, we'd just need to grab a lot of them. If, or, if to, or if you went to, like, lens crafters or something, then I'd have to be surprised, actually. I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. I see. But don't you need a pair? Do they make bear head sized glasses? Ooh, good point. Another great question. Listen to this. My eyes themselves are lenses. Oh, that's clever. You didn't know? No. How would we have? Of course not. Why are you being so mean? You act like you're not interested. I'm a really dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move? <laughs> what am I even looking at? Ow! Hmm? You dropped something. Oh great, these. You'll you'll see. Just just wait. Oh, that's a pair I kinda screwed up on. Ooh. <laughs> uh, um, Yukiko? <laughs> How do I look? Oh, God. Uh, um. I'm gonna say it doesn't fit you because everything else seems kind of rude. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like that one, Yuki-chan? I want to wear this one. It's even got a nose guard. Oh, oh, no you don't. How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. Oh yeah, you you haven't seen the depths of Teddy's awful puns yet. Just believe me. I guess I should have made an actual pair. Aw, oh, too bad. Here, Chie, your turn. Ah, oh, man. All right, fine. This will be good. to this <laughs> Teddy you're all you're to blame for all of this Yukiko-san hello there goes one of Yukiko's laughing fits I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around these stupid glasses are useless for investigating I mean what the hell's this nose for anyway Comedic value Nice work, huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone, and I get bored. Well, I'm glad that she's in high spirits again, I guess. Well, this is a good sign that she's back to normal, which is good. <laughs> oh, Chie, the look on your face. <laughs> it was so funny. I can't stop. This is going to be a great adventure, isn't it? The fourth and the fifth. 
What? What? Where? Where did the first and the eighth? What? What is? I think I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> really? Really? What? You don't believe me? It's always cancelled. Not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunesse, but I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a trip? Uh, well, it might be okay to go on a trip once in a while. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Oh yeah, it's the uh, Japan's National Week Off, I guess. A bunch of holidays all rammed in one week. Yay! <laughs> We're going on a trip! Hmm. Alright, alright. Then we need to think of some place to go. If she says Juness. How about you? You want to come along with us? Sure. Yeah, well, let's all go together. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. Bring box lunches. Hmm? Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. Isn't that kind of what most of Japanese cuisine is? Mostly just side dishes, mostly. But uh, I can't cook, and Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. Well, I'll help. Hmm. Well, it'll work out. That's what we got this guy for, huh, Nanako? Yay! Box lunches! You know, this family's actually, actually pretty cool. Very strange, these two, but then again, who isn't strange? I gotta look at another list online. I found a... Go upstairs. Yeah, let's go to sleep, I guess. Apparently my list was for the days where you, where we, where you can make your own, um, make your lunch to bring to school. Not the, uh, days of spoiled food. So I'll have to look for that. It's gonna rain today? If it's gonna rain, then maybe someone will show up, but... Oh, that, oh, that, that is a very good idea. Yeah, that is a very good idea. We do need to grind, too, for the next, um, next dungeon. We do need to grind. Oh, and, uh, what that means is that I should be able to show you Yukiko's... Oh, yeah, my four, my 400 yen. She's a little stronger than us. That's what I didn't want to have to go through. But that's Yukiko. She's level 15 when you get her. Meaning she's a little stronger than me. But she's a healer. She can heal, cast fire, heal status elements, and cast fire on all enemies. And her next thing is Media, which is Dia All, basically. Yukiko's actually pretty good. I mean, she's good for the beginning part until you get another character, and then she's to totally replaced. And in four levels, Yosuke can hit everyone with wind. And my person is going to change before the next dungeon, so we'll change in the beginning of the next dungeon, if at all possible. Let me grab my notes, which are, again, not next to me, like I keep saying that I'm going to keep them. Okay, I need two, two Persona from the next dungeon to um, get the next Persona that I want. So, I gotta do a little bit of work. But, I can get the Persona that I want later. Yeah, but basically this basically this says like, oh, if you go to, if you gather everyone at the food court, you can't build a social link today. But 
that's fine because I don't know if any of them are are, except, are um, available today. We're going in the TV. All right, let's go. Um, probably nothing today. Oh, a powerful shadow in the castle, huh? Hmm. Well, we'll go do that, Teddy. That, that was the alert of, of an optional boss. Right now, we have, we have next to no hope of beating him right now. For level 20, he's a piece of cake. So, we're going to we're, we're gonna level 20. But first, what I've been talking about for what, the whole LP right now... Yeah, no, you don't want to go. Well, we're going to go. We're going to go because it's important. Yeah, I've uh, talked about this the entire LP, but we're going to go get it now because I can now. Skill Spanner. And that is a weapon for Yosuke. It's very strong, but it has a pretty low accuracy, but that's fine for right now. And it gives him f 40 more magic power, which is, re which is really good. Fortunately, he doesn't have to keep that 40 SP. Or gain that, or keep... Uh, get the addition of... I, you, you know what I mean. He doesn't get to keep that bonus. And, well, I guess this is uh, where, where we're going to part ways for, for this week. Because I'm going to go grind my tail feathers off. Because we need to be level 20 for the next dungeon. I'm not kidding, level 20. That's the minimum that I'm going to accept. Let me see how much work i got to do with my links, too. If I can get two more levels out of that, I'll be happy. I need to get one more with her, and then I'll be happy. That's all I can all I have right now. I have like no social links right now. But don't worry, we'll we'll get we'll get more as, as the game progresses. And I'll max out a lot of them, but not all of them. Not by a long shot. I maxed out. I master all of them. I, I will get my I will get my party my, my party members maxed out though. I will do that, and I can promise that I'll do that. But I don't think I'll be able to get everything completely or anything outside my party level uh, perfected. But in this game, you really don't need anything but your party maxed out. Unless you're going for alternate personas and things, and I can't be bothered to do that because it's. Trust me, you'll see. You'll see at end game how how how, how much how much effort it takes to get an ultimate persona. You'll see. So I'm gonna grind. We're gonna be a lot stronger, and I'm gonna have uh, some actual money next time. So until then, guys. Okay.